Hello everyone, this is Raj from Crypto Passive. Today we're looking at something a bit different. We're not looking at your traditional HYPs or anything like that. Today we're looking at something called the Chia Network. Now, they're actually a new blockchain and uh, they go, um, they have a coin, it's, it's called XCH. And uh, they actually have uh, where, you know, a situation where you can actually mine and farm these coins for money. Uh, the difference is that this is done through your home computer. It doesn't require any technical skills. What it requires is simply hard disk space. So it doesn't use your CPU much. It doesn't use your GPU much. So it's more energy efficient. It's unlike, you know, Ethereum or Bitcoin mining where you have to use up a lot of electricity. Uh, it's a very simple process um, and uh, it's available for Windows, uh, Mac and also Linux as well. So this is something we'll um, have a read of this actually. They, uh, they're they fairly new coin. Uh, they, uh, they, they call themselves the eco-friendly blockchain, a, a new digital currency called Chia. So it's basically a open sourced uh, decentralized network that operates uh, a payment settlement system using Chia, it's native cryptocurrency. Um, they, their, their founder is someone called Bram Cohen, who's the founder of the BitTorrent, uh, network. So he's, um, you know, it's, it's now a very popular, uh, farming situation. Uh, and a lot of people are starting to use this. So I just wanted to do something and show you how this works. Um, they basically, uh, you can see over here, Cheers blockchain offers functional environmental advantages to Bitcoin, Ethereum, and Ripple's existing platform. Um, their blockchain replaces the proof of work, which is a consensus method that Bitcoin and Ethereum use uh, with its first of a kind proof of space and time. So basically, um, it, it's very simple to use. So you can see Compared to the existing modern finance platform, it's the easiest digital money to farm. In contrast, to the technically proficient skills required to join a minor community, all people can farm Chia at home for a fraction of the cost. So what you do is you download the blockchain into your computer and you just start earning the rewards. So uh, it's fairly new, this one. Um, the... Uh, let's try and use a calculator. Now it does use a fair bit of hard disk space. So you can see um, how much can you earn from this? And that's what everyone wants to know, right? So essentially uh, you create something called plots and each plot will take up um, about roughly three, uh, 300 gigs or so for, for oh, I'm sorry, 100, 100 gigs or so per plot. So essentially for 10 plots, you will end up using about a terabyte of space. So this is 1,014 1, gigabyte, which is one terabyte of space. So how much can you earn from this? So essentially what you'll be doing is uh, you will need to set your computer, of course, I mean, you know, 24 seven, you just leave it running and uh, you'd be looking at earning roughly about 16, Sixteen dollars and thirty cents a month, uh, which uh, earns up to fifty-four cents a day. But you know, as it goes along, it just all adds up. So uh, the more you plot, of course, the more hard this you you've got. So if you've got a lot of, you know, this is one terabyte. If you've got a lot of disk space, uh, say two, three, or four terabytes, then of course this amount is going to, uh, you know, uh, double. Uh, or triple depending on the space you got. So you can, if you have got three terabytes, you can earn $50 a month, uh, or about $600 a year, which is not too bad. So, but this is a very easy thing. It's a set and forget, you install it and off you go. And it just plots away and it just does everything automatically. The way I have it set up is I've downloaded this. I use a Mac. 
I've downloaded this and I have an external USB drive with a lot of space. So I actually send all of, all of that into that hard drive and just let it do its work. I usually keep my computer on 24 seven when I go to bed, it goes to sleep, but you know, everything else like the hard drive and everything works. So you can't actually put it to total sleep where even your hard drive is not working, in which case it'll start replotting everything over again. So we'll go into the into the um, the app itself. So the app uh, basically, uh, this is um, I've just I just set it up today, and it's still syncing, uh, and it's got all this information here, the blocks and everything, and it takes a while to plot uh, to to do one plot. So if you go over here, you can see I'm still plotting here at the default so you you can create each plot like i said is about 100 101 gigs uh each plot so you can see it's still plotting it's 11 percent so and then i've got many others as well so i've got uh various different hard drives as well so um i use um you know i i could use maybe i don't know about 20 30 plots for possibly with with the hard disk space i've got um, but I have not tried it. I've got a, a network attached storage in NAS. So I wonder if I could plot it to that. That would be great because I've got terabytes of space on there. Then I can, you know, plot maybe 40 or 50 plots and, and earn uh, a lot more because this all works on the basis of hard disk space, you see? So now it's, uh, it's queuing these. I've, I've, I've just added five plots and now it's just queued everything. So if you go into say, um, and if you go into farm, oh, next thing it'll ask you, as soon as you install this Chia wallet, it'll ask you to add the wallet. So in this wallet, it'll ask you, the first thing it'll ask you is the 24, it'll give you the 24 uh, seed words that you'll have to actually write it down or copy and paste it into your notes or whatever, but you cannot lose that because if your drive gets formatted and stuff, you would lose it without the key. So make sure you put that down. Once that's done, your whole wallet uh, shows up like this, and then you're asked to add a plot uh, and your wallet, uh, it shows, and this is how it'll show to add a plot. So you come over here, you just say add a plot, and over here, you'll choose the plot size. So you can choose, you know, uh, you don't want to choose a 600 meg one. You want to use 100 gigs and more to be effective. So you can use different plot sizes, uh, 100 gigs, 200 gigs, 430 gigs, or 884. Of course, these things will take a hell of a long time to plot, to finish a complete plot if you go with the with a higher block. So the the recommended one would be like 101 gigs and then you can create several plots here you can choose the amount of plots you want and then you can just go i've just added um, um more you know initially I added one then i added a few more so now you can plot in parallel as well what that means is if you keep adding more it'll all start plotting at the same time now, i don't recommend that because when you start doing that, it starts overworking your drives. It starts churning your CPUs. It start, you know, a, a lot of um, energy starts getting expended. So I suggest you, you add this to the queue, let it all plot, let it finish all the plotting. And then once it finishes the plotting, uh, then it goes into the next stage where it starts farming. And that's where you start making your your earnings uh, through the farming. But initially it has to plot each one. So in order to do that, so I'm, I'm gonna, uh, just for this video, I'm gonna add another plot. So what I'll do is I'm gonna add, so you gotta select a temporary directory. Now a temporary directory usually will take up quite a bit of space. So in this case, uh, over here, it says it'll take up 239 gigs of space. So you need to assign a, a temporary directory. So I'm just going to go and browse in here. Um, I've got a couple of drives. Uh, this one actually, you know, I have uh, how much space do I have on this one? Let's see. So on this one, I have 714 gigs available. So I'm going to go ahead and plot 
uh, use this. I've created, what you do is for a temporary directory, you, you need to create a directory called Chia, or temp, a temporary directory for Chia, and then you need to create one for the main one. So I've created one called Chia temp and one called Chia plot. So the temporary, I'll just add this and open that. And then this is the temporary directory. Now, going to the next one, what will be the final directory, which is not temporary, which, which will take up like, you know, the 100 gigs, because the temporary is going to take up to 39. So I've got the one set up as the Chia main one. So it's called the Chia plot. I'll add that. So both of them are selected. And then all I do now is create the plot. So what it does is it puts that into the queue. So once this completes 100%, then this one starts ticking along. So it's going to take a good, I don't know, um, for these number of plots, it's going to take a good, I don't know, day and a half, two days to finish everything. But once it finishes, it then moves to the next stage, which is the farming stage. So once all of, you know, I guess once this is finished, it'll go to the farming, then this will start plotting and then yada, yada, yada. So when you go to farm, so here it's going to show you all the farm stats. So once, once this reaches a hundred percent, this will then show the stats over here. And then it's going to show everything of what's happening everything here so so basically in the farming section it's it's where it's gonna where you're gonna start earning so it's gonna take a while i mean it's i mean you know you don't you don't make a whole lot of money but hey look if you're not using your hard disk space you may as well put it to good use right and and just start you know may as well get some extra earnings with that um, over here, you will show up if you need to make any trades, you need to create an offer, um, view offer. Now, I, I, I'm not sure how this, this works because I'm also pretty new to this. I just wanted to show you how it works. And over here, uh, this is where you kind of import it. So once you lose, if you, if you end up formatting your drives, you will import it from the 24 words. And then uh, this is your private key. You, kick, you click on that and it takes you back uh, to where it is. So that's pretty much it for this. So I'm just going to wait until it starts doing, you know, going from the plotting stage to the farming stage. But I thought it was really interesting uh, and it's really picking up pace. A lot of people are now, you know, starting to move into this direction because um, when you look at the Ethereum mining and Bitcoin mining, you know, it takes up, you know, a lot of electricity, a lot of energy. Um, and it, this is also environmentally friendly in the sense that it's not using your CPU power or GPU power. It's simply using your hard drive storage space to do the farming. So which is which is pretty, pretty. It's a pretty cool technology, I thought. But. Again, you know, if, if you're not using, I've got so much space on my drive that I thought, heck, you know, why not put it to use? I got my computer on 24 seven anyway. So this, this would be a very cool way to earn some extra income. Um, but it's going to take some time for it to, to, uh, for the process because, you know, it's, uh, the storage space required is pretty big. So you can imagine to plot one terabyte is going to take quite a while. So that's it guys. So I can, I'll probably do another video with an update, um, you know, after a few days to see how the plots are going and so forth. But this is not your typical HYPs where you will make big earnings, but this is kind of like, uh, let's put it this way. It's risk-free, uh, you, you know, it doesn't cost you anything to join. Uh, it's all free. You download the software to your computer and you let it run, let it farm, and that's it. You know, there's so there's there's no risk involved over here. So I would, you know, if 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 you are if you're interested in this, you know, give it a go and see how you go. Uh, but I thought it, it would be something, you know, since we're in the in the earnings um, mode, I thought, hey, look, why not? You know, this is another option for people to have while their hard drives are sitting there 
you know, may as well take advantage of it. So thank you for watching this video. And I really urge you to, you know, subscribe and like this channel and like this channel and, and please join our Telegram group. It's all going to be there under the description. And thanks again.